Have you ever wondered to yourself, what's your purpose in life? My purpose is to enjoy myself until I pass away. Okay, when you pass away, do you not think Fine. you should, is that your only purpose, to have the fun? Yes. Look, look my at- My purpose into, is to make the best out of life. Okay, but look, think about it, yeah? You have animals, cows and sheep and- Don't start this, because I this. just had a half an hour discussion oh. about a uh, <laughs> uh, fuck it. Okay. With a vegan guy, oh, no, 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 we no, 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 no. kill a fucking chicken. No, 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 we can, we can. We, we are halal, we can eat meat, no problem. The yeah, point yeah. I'm saying is this, if we look at a cow, a cow eats, drinks, sleeps, defecates, and repeats the cycle. Yeah. We are greater than animals. Yeah. We cannot live like them. So the point is, there has to be a greater purpose to happiness. Happiness, how do you define happiness? Do Everyone you... defines them in their own way, yeah. Okay, but how old are you? I'm 18. 18, my name's Ali, what's your name? Brian. Brian, nice to meet you. What's your name, mate? Come on. Huh? Come on. Come on. Hoping this come on. This, this, this will be some good shit. Bob, 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 Bob. Okay. So listen, you guys are young. You know there has to be a greater purpose to life. No. Nah. Okay, okay. What's the purpose of this? To fulfill a need. Good. So, but the point is the following. As a human being, you are more far in complex and design. Yeah, you have, your body is filled with billions and trillions of bacteria, etc. who have a specific function. How could you tell me those little microscopic bacteria on a nano level has a purpose, but you're here to just have fun? There must be a greater purpose. There has to be a greater purpose. No, there doesn't. Of course it does. Your being as a human being, and not only that, this person who made this jacket, yeah. would you, if you got this jacket and bought it off the owner, or, or the one who made it, yeah. and you went and put it in fire, yeah. they, would you not come and tell you this is not suitable for fire? It's not designed to be, yeah, yeah, it, no, exactly, yeah, good. Okay. Good, so the point is this. Anything that you buy, most things that you buy comes with a guide, like how yeah. to use it. Good. You as a human being, you need to acknowledge that there has to be a higher being that's created you. No. Okay, where did you come from? My mother. What okay, you where did your mom come from? Her mother. Okay, and where did her mom come from? It'll go on forever, exactly. So what I'm saying is, you but, don't but, believe in God? But listen, but listen, but then yeah. you can apply the same principle to what you just said, yeah. with there being a higher level being, but you just reflect the question. Because if I say, where did God come from, right? You, You'll say he's always been there. No, you just he, reflect. He, not reflect, he has to be all there. Because if you come and say that who created him, then he's not God anymore. Yes, but when you, when you try and disprove the science... Um, what science? What science got to do with wait, God? Wait, wait, wait. If you try and disprove the... What's the word? Like, like this, there's two theories of life, innit? There's God or there's science. If you try no. and disprove science, no. right, then, you, then the same reasoning you use to disprove science, you can use to disprove God. The mm. thing is with you, you'll just say, oh yeah, God has to be there the whole time. I'll, I'll bring evidence. Science, science does not conflict God. Darwin, Richard uh, Darwin. Yes, you know yeah. Darwin, yeah? Yeah, evolution. Da yeah, Darwin, read Darwin's book. Darwin, al Darwin always believed in God. He said, when my uh, faith fluctuated at its highest, I never not believed in God. So he but believed in God. But most science and God doesn't contradict each other. Most of scientists believe in God purely for the reason that there was no reason not to believe in no, God. No, I'll give you- don't lose anything for believing in God. That's why they believed in God. Science and God is not contradictory. Science deals with the, deals with the observable reality. Science doesn't deal with the metaphysical. So what I'm saying is the following, very simply. You, for example, are you composed of DNA? Yes. Okay, what is DNA? DNA is information. Yeah. DNA is information, the fact that you look the way you look and the way I look, and yeah. the other animals and uh, beings in our world. Yeah, okay, that information requires intelligence. What do you mean by that? If I give you a book, it, yeah. does the book have information? Yes. Information requires an intelligent person that wrote it. Sure. Good. But we, we, but the 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 data has always been there. No, 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 no. One second. Where does the data even come from? From our parents. No, no, no. I'm talking about from the very beginning. DNA. The first cell we're talking about. A first yeah. cell has a uh, a nucleus. Okay. Mm. Where DNA. There's genes. And yeah. there's, gen there's genome. And there's genes. And inside those genes, there are DNA. Yeah. DNA has information. Meaning, yes. the way you look, the way you look, and the way I look. The way our ears stop here, not it's information. But plants also contain DNA Good. of how they are formed. Exactly. So what I'm saying is the following: if there is information, there has to be intelligence. Right or wrong? Tell me if I'm wrong. You're wrong. Okay, tell me why I'm wrong. You're wrong. I don't even know how to explain it. It's just like you can't tell me, right? That you can't tell me that God exists. But evolution is real because they What's conflict evolution? each other. No, it doesn't. Yes, uh, Darwin, it does. is, Darwin, was an Darwin is the one who came with evolution yes. theory. Evolution has got nothing to do with God. You need to understand the following. Evolution doesn't take God out of the picture because it goes back to where did the first cell come from? Yeah. The first cell, it either came from something or they can't be anything else. It can't be came from nothing. because it, it came from algae. Okay, where did, what is algae? Algae, 
I don't know how to describe no, no, it. No, no, exactly. The first cell is a very complex thing. The first cell, like I said to you before, do you know recent studies show, you know they talk about the random mutation. There is no random mutation. There is targeted mutation, meaning the cell actually communicates, you know the cell membrane around it, yeah. and there's the nucleus in the, yeah. in the, in the uh, middle, yeah? yeah? Which has the genomes and the genes and the DNA. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They are train-like, look, listen to me, tube-like systems in place yeah. that send information from the membrane to the nucleus. Let me ask you a question. It's the following. Imagine my hand as being the nucleus yeah. and Scotland is where the membrane is of the cell. There is information being sent down to the nucleus. I'll ask you a simple question. There's movement happening. What is telling these tube, it's called tubulines, yeah? Something like that. What, who is telling this information to travel to, one second, we are made out of cells. You are made out of cells. Who is giving this information to these beings, these little creatures, nano level, yeah? To one second, travel one second, to the cell. One, one second, one second. Sorry. Yeah, carry on. Who is giving the information to these cells to operate in that Listen, manner? You're clearly far more educated than no, me. No, no, it's so about education. Look, no, I'm, it, it I'm is not about trying education. to outsmart you. I'm saying I'm not, use your logic. I'm not you're saying, smart. I'm not you saying you're trying to outsmart me. The thing is, if I was far more educated, I'd be able to, to argue this with a purpose. The no. fact that I'm not as educated as you. I right? promise you, you are an intelligent no. man. You don't need to be intelligent. I'm, I'm not saying I'm not intelligent. You, I'm just saying I'm less educated listen, on the subject itself. If I went to my little daughter, my daughter would say, all this has to come from somewhere. It's not, don't, don't say it's about matter of intelligence because you are a smart, intelligent guy. I'm telling you very simple. Would you accept the following? Can zero ever equal one? Nothing. Can ever something come from nothing? Zero can equal one if, you, if, you, if, if zero to the power zero equal one. Zero is the absence of something. But zero is fictional. If you look at okay. mathematics, zero good, is good. not it's real. Ab it's abstract. Okay, now, I'm talking to you about nothing. Nothing is the absence of something. There is not a single thing there. Sure. How could you get something from nothingness? Impossibility. Zero cannot equal one. So the point I'm saying is you don't need to be a genius. You know if the universe began to exist, which did, if you're going to go by science, they yeah. say the universe began to exist. Yeah. What caused it to begin? The Big Bang. No, no. The Big Bang is the explosion. What caused it to explode? This is what I'm saying. There has to be a look. But, I say, but, but yeah, which one's more reasonable? We, we don't have a fucking clue why the Big Bang came the way it came, right? You don't, you, but I don't, we also I don't. don't have a fucking clue how God came the way he came. You can't tell me he's been there forever because that just doesn't that no, doesn't no. work around the concept of time. There's no you way that God has been there you can. forever. Infinity, you can. Yeah, for cool. God, for but, God, but, you can. But then. If he has been there forever, why did he choose to make Earth when he made Earth? Why did he make it a, like a hundred thousand years beforehand? Okay you're, you know I mean? okay, you're talking about why God did a certain thing, but it doesn't take God out of the picture. If I come and say to you, what's your name again? Brian. I'm going to say I don't believe in Brian because Brian did something that doesn't make sense to me. Brian but, doesn't exist. But you can see me. I'm physically here. You can touch me. God. You can see me. You I can, can see God. I can say, God is a fictional being in I, your I can say I'm in the Matrix. Believe. I think I'm in a GTA game and I think cool. you don't exist. Cool. I can go down that route. I can come and say, I, cool. I don't think you're real. I don't think I'm talking to you. Maybe I'm talking but, but to nothing. Enough reason, Do you get what I'm saying? There is enough proof good. to suggest that I am real. There Thank is you. no proof good, good. to suggest that God is real. There is more proof that God exists than you exist. There's more proof. You no, exist than proof that God Yes. Okay, give, Let me, me, tell you something. give me one piece of proof. I can't lie. Very, very simple, very simple, very simple. I'll make it very simple, yeah? I talk to you about the DNA. Yeah. I said to you, DNA is a but, molecule but that you, has information. But you saying that something is very complex does not prove that God exists. That is you stating that is very complex. No, no, no. I'm telling you, for example, let me give you an example, yeah? Of, a, uh, you know, bacteria. Yeah. Bacteria have a tail. It's called a flagella. Yeah, okay. Cool. Now there's a biologist called um, Michael Behe. Yes. He looks at the tail. They do a microscopic nano level. When I mean nano level, you know, on a teaspoon, yeah. they can fit 40, no, I, 4 I know, billion I know of those regions. Now, is, yeah. now, when they zoom in, they see that the tail has a motor. Do you know what a motor is? Okay, motor, you know that our, our car has a motor, our two, electronic toothbrush has a motor. Um, our, there's many things that have a motor. You know a motor? I'm not sure. It's like, it's like a mini engine. A motor? A motor, oh, okay, for the yeah, yeah, pronunciation. Yeah, 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 a motor, yes? Okay, now, they look and they see that it has 40 parts. Okay. Meaning the following, if one part was missing, it would not function. So that flagella, that tail, that propels the bacteria to travel a specific distance, the question is the following. If I showed you an engine of a Ferrari, would you say it's designed? 
But, but you're just... You're, I'm asking you, a simple question. You said... But listen... Would you, you say it's designed? You've reiterated the same points that you basically just used the I is too complex multiple I, times I, I, this I, I, I'm, not, I'm, I'm just saying to you, if I showed you a but Ferrari... You've used this argument several times. You show, but, but And several but times you, you failed to but answer. You, but you, you telling me yeah. that something is too complex, right, does not prove that God exists. It's a fact stating that it is complex. Let's no, no, he's, let's, he's, let's, he's basically I, making the point I, that if you see a design, like yes. a motor or like yes. even something I'm like sorry, a I'm sorry, I have to take this. This is the second time he's calling no, it's fine, it's fine. Give say, me two seconds. Yeah. Saved by the bell. I'll come back, I'll come back. No, I'm just kidding. He's joking, he's joking. So basically what he's trying to do is he's saying the process, okay, yeah. he's, you're explaining the mechanism to yes. him, but what you need to tell him yeah. is that after every, behind everything that is, that yes. you see a design, yes. there is an agent. I, I told him that. I didn't, I, I didn't even mention the mention complex. Yeah. I didn't even say the word complex. My issue is that when we look at a motor, if you look at a car engine, yeah. it has certain parts in it that make it function the way it does. When the, we was doing a thing with Sabori yesterday about the flagella, the flagella is basically the tail that propels the bacteria to go. They, on a microscopic level, on a nano level, you, when you zoom in, it's a flipping motor, bro. You, your mind will stop. And the question you ask is the following. If I was to show him that and said, this is something that's made by the Ferrari to propel the Ferrari argument, say, you see, that's an intelligent guy, intelligent whatever. But the same thing, and by the way, these bacteria, you can fit four billion of them with that flagella on a teaspoon. So the question is, where did that come from? He's like, oh no. But Actually, so, the example I use normally is the DNA. Yeah, same, DNA. I did the DNA, we went past that. Yeah, so we the, went past the, the DNA. The DNA is so yeah. easy to understand. Yes. At the same time, yes. you will have to agree that this is a code, yes. and quite a complex code, not a yes, not yes, yes. That's, and behind every code, there must be someone who coded it. Exactly, must exactly. Be a, there exactly. Must be a, you see a program, yeah, yeah. there must be a program. Yeah, yeah. no, it, 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 it's yeah, the message. like five minutes before my sorry, 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 sorry. Yeah, so, no, no, in a nutshell, what I was saying is the following. We were talking about that thing. Yeah. We're saying that it's composed of 40 pieces. Yes. Okay. And it's it's rev, like, you know you have a car rev, RPM. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, it's 20,000. Okay, meaning the way that it can, it activates, it works. Now the question I'm asking the following, if I was to show you a Bugatti and I show you the engine, you will come and look at it and be like, that is a phenomenal design made by yeah. somebody with a purpose. And when I show you a bacteria... And it is a fact that, is that it is phenomenally designed, but it doesn't prove that God exists. Okay, so does a design have a designer? But this, this argument has been used so many times. If I was more it's educated, it's I'd be able to. So you have blind faith. Argue this. No, no, but you don't need to. It's, it's logic. Look, if, but it's, if it's, when you see it's a design, logic. for example, you see this design. Somebody made it, right? Yeah. You're not going to say it just popped out of existence. Cool. So when you see design throughout the universe, including the most microscopic thing like a molecule or an atom or even like a snowflake. Cool. You see, you, you yeah. don't just say that all of this just popped into existence. From I'm nowhere. not saying it popped into existence. So what, what is the cause then? What is the cause of all you this? You know what it is? You have blind faith in science. No. You know people say we have blind I, faith. Listen, listen. Yeah. I don't believe in much science. I don't believe in God and religion. I live the way I think life works. Therefore, That's fine. I'm not saying... But could you be wrong? Of course. Okay, so I'm that's, not, that's what we're trying to talk about. If you don't have trust I'm, in your own self. I'm saying in my reality, God yeah. doesn't exist. Why is I'm that? Not, I'm not saying that science is 100% right. Okay. But I'm saying in my reality, God doesn't exist because that is a far-fetched idea with no proof. Okay. Science what kind of proof would you require in order to believe that there is a God? Let's see if you have a criteria. You, you'd, you'd have to prove to me in some aspect No, no, that you said God, there is no proof. So I'm assuming... No, no, no. Yeah, I'm saying there is no proof that God exists. Bro, let me finish so, the statement. Okay, yeah, okay. sure. My bad. When you are looking for a proof, for example, if I asked you, uh, have you lost your key? And if you say yes, you should know at least what the key looks like. Yeah. So you can identify it when you find it. Yeah. Okay, now if you were looking for God, yeah. what proof would you require to say, okay, now I know that God exists? Okay, so t tell me this, how would you prove that? God Answer the question, bro. I'd need you, you the question, right? I'd need you to physically show me something that has ties to the idea of God being real. Okay, when you are looking for something, anything, including God, look, what are you looking for? Exactly, you need I'll, a criteria, right? I'll give you an example. If yeah. Jesus was real at some mm -hmm. point in time, that would be proof that God exists because he did miracles. He did miracles which were so, beyond reality. So you believe right? in Jesus? No. I'm saying, What's let, the me, point of let me finish, let me yeah, finish. Yeah. If Jesus yeah. was 
around that. This time, that would be enough to convince me. But the fact that Jesus was something that people just way, wrote no down. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah, 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 I am passionate. I know, I know. Um, if, if, God was, if Jesus was around at this time, then I'd believe it. But the fact that the, the things that Jesus did were written down and passed down through word of mouth through thousands of years make me believe that less and less because you could hear something that I said and misinterpret it within five seconds of me saying it. You understand? Yeah. But, so if, if but what, what I'm saying is I'm, I'm talking about a different thing. For example, look. You're saying what you, you believe need. You believe that you are real, you exist. Yes. You believe that the universe is real, yeah. it exists, right? Now, anything that begins to exist yeah. must have a cause. Yeah. What is the cause for the universe? As I said. Don't say I don't we, know. No. Because that's not an answer. But, but, but no one knows what the cause of uni the universe is, as well as but it has to be a But cause. does but, it have a cause? But, but 100%. Okay. But we, Could we, it be the universe but itself? We don't, we don't understand science enough to establish a cause. The same way that if I was to ask you, what was the cause of God? Because the same way you said everything has to have a cause. Yeah. What is the cause of God? Where did God come from? Okay. Okay. Cool. I, can, I can answer that, no problem. Cool. But so, where, let no, me get. A question. I will. You have answered my question or you haven't yet? What was your question? What is the cause of the universe? As I said, we don't have the knowledge okay. to understand the So you don't have an answer to that. Am yeah. I clear? Okay, now you ask about God. Because the universe began to exist, it must have a cause. Yeah. God did not begin to exist. It God doesn't have a cause. He is the cause. Okay. Does so, that answer your question? So, no, it doesn't. Because, well, which part it doesn't? But, but then Logically, it does. But then logically you could say the universe always existed it has no cause no you because could, the, you could say the exact same thing you believe in science right yeah the scientists themselves said the universe began to exist 3.8 billion years ago yeah so if you believe in science now you're saying it could have existed forever but, but, but they themselves say when that the universe began to exist at, at 3.8 billion years ago but what's you know what's very interesting okay you're, you're, so it must have a cause you know what's interesting you're saying god cannot be forever but you a minute ago you said the universe was always there exactly no, you didn't. No, said could I, have I, I, I didn't. I didn't say was. I okay. said could have been the same okay. way. Can it be, could, it be, could it be God? No. Okay, one second. Look, it, I, could, I, it could be universe. We cannot be God. Yeah. I believe that Your the God idea. Is the I believe <laughs> that the idea of a God of a single creature responsible for everything is very far fetched. Why is that? But you just said a single universe could be could be there but all the time. Universe, I want to know why. The single why? universe is composed of billions of exactly. things. galaxies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Billions of things. Exactly. Which the more you look into, the more there is. If you look into a universe, you see galaxies, you see planets, yeah. you see... You All see, created. Yes, but if you look at God, it's just one thing. Why is, why is it impossible? Why is it impossible? In my... If, in, God, is in, if God is all-powerful... I'm not saying it's impossible, I'm saying it's far-fetched. No, why is it far-fetched? You know what is far-fetched? To believe that the universe did not have a cause. Yeah. I'm not saying you're saying that. Yeah. Because you agreed it has a cause, right? It's the biggest but the thing is, for you, for you to understand, look, the universe itself couldn't be the cause, right? Because it didn't exist at one point. I mean, it could be. Give but me something it's plausible as well. Okay, give me something plausible. What As brought I said, the universe I'm into not, existence? I'm not this educated in the subject. To but you seem to be. You, you seem logical, that, as a very confident. Yeah, I, that the year, that yeah. God doesn't exist. I'm a very, but all of a sudden, when I ask about a, the universe, you have no idea. I'm a very confident person when it comes to something that I know about. Yeah, but it's emotional. It's you, not you, reasoning. You, you seem more confident in something you don't know about. It's hey. emotional. You seem more confident about not knowing something. You're exactly, like, I don't yeah. know, I don't know, but you seem very confident. But, no, You're no, because when there's something where there isn't a definite answer, I am confident that there isn't a definite okay. answer. There is a definite answer that the universe began to exist. And if it began to exist, a and, being gave rise to it. And there's no it's, it's definite simple. answer that God is real. There is. No, it is. It's very simple. No, but you're saying, look, you keep saying exist. that, yeah. but that is from emotion, not from reasoning. Yeah. Logically, you don't have any reason to say why it doesn't exist. Logically, there is not enough reason. It is not enough proof to back up the fact that, that is actually exists. because Billions. the universe like i said it is dependent so it must have a cause the universe didn't the universe began to exist now what is a plausible explanation from where the universe came from so one is people will say that it, it created itself but that's impossible because at one point it's it far-fetched i wouldn't say no impossible. it's impossible because it didn't exist at one point yeah. so it couldn't have created itself it's like saying a mother gave birth to herself is it's, that, it's, it's like as, saying God, it's as bad God as just came about. No, no, no. It's as bad as saying, listen to this. It's as bad as saying a mother gave birth to herself. Mm -hmm. Okay? Okay. That is not only far-fetched, that's impossible. Just it's illogical. Do you agree? Respectfully, yeah, we can just agree to disagree. No, this is impossible. We can a genuinely mother... just agree okay, to so disagree. You, you have different opinions. So you I disagree. Wait, wait. We can argue about this Hold tonight. On. Do you disagree that the mother gave birth to herself? Or do you agree with that? Do you believe a mother can give birth to herself? No. Exactly. So we are in agreement. 
Don't okay. say we agree to disagree. We no, agree to agree. Yeah. About about <laughs> this one point, sure. But I'm saying yes. in in the grand scheme of things, whether God is real or whether the universe or whether there's a scientific back, it, uh, back it's backing. Trying, it's trying, it's trying no, to make it down. For it doesn't need. Why it doesn't need to have a scientific backing because science is limited. I'll tell you why. And God is isn't limited. God is not limited. Okay. Unlike unlike science. You know, you know, sci can I just ask one question? Yeah, yeah. Do you, how do you know your mother's your mother? She gave birth to me. How do you know? No, that? no, no. Let's go with science. No, no, how do you know that? How do you know your mother gave birth to you? DNA. Have, have, you done, done, have you done it? Have you done a DNA? I test? could do it. And have you it? done it though? I could do it and prove so it. So you have faith I, now that your mother is your mother without You no believed evidence. it without proof. The same with me, no, the same with me. I'm not trying to be but, funny. But, but, but no, 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 but you see the difference Testimony. between. Testimony. But the, the difference between that is I have faith because there is backing where if. What backing? Listen, I want evidence. listen, listen. If I wanted to prove it, I could go do a DNA but at test. But at the time you don't. I could prove have it. Have you? But I could. But have you? But, but no, at this no, no, point, no, but, is my faith. Okay. At this me, moment, do you believe me, your mother's your mother or not? Let me let me finish. Okay. Yeah. Because I could prove it, I have faith. Because I know that if I wanted to, I could prove it. The the fact that God exists, I could have faith that God exists. But because I can't prove it, I'm not gonna believe in it. So do you have faith now? Your mother's your mother, or yes. you're not for certain? You have faith. You have no evidence. So if I come and say to you, scientifically, at this stage of time, your mother is not your mother, until proven otherwise. I do a DNA test. But can I agree and say that your mother is not your mother at this moment of time until you bring the scientific evidence? No. So no, because there's eyewitnesses. You just went against science. Also, it's, it's you, there's, there's, eyewit there's other ways of proving it. That's good. Yeah. That's what I'm talking cool, about. Cool. That's called there testimony. is other ways of proving it's something. Testimony. Good, that's what I'm saying. And, so and testimony we, mm. is one of those. That's what I was trying to get. Ali, I want to ask him something. Yeah. You keep saying there's no proof for God. Yeah. Yet you have no idea what proof you're seeking. Am I right? To an extent. So how how can you As say? As I said, if if I saw how some, can you say there's no proof when you don't something. know what the proof is? If I saw something live in the flesh, I'm not saying that there's an agenda to. Oh, to you find need out. empirical evidence. Is that what you're saying? I need. You want to see it? I need. I, yes, I need physical yeah. proof. It's called so, empirical evidence. Sure. So you require empir empirical evidence yeah. for God. Let me ask you this: Do you have empirical evidence that you have consciousness? I guess not. Thank you. I rest my case. Sure, but, 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 there's, but there's also empirical evidence that we can't. Uh, that but we, you believe you have consciousness. That's the point. Without you don't empirical evidence, face. but when it comes to God, you require empirical evidence. You see Why the devil's standards? So what we're saying is, you're conscious and you cannot touch, smell, one taste, sec, feel, or hear it. Okay. So uh, you know what we're doing? What we're trying to just do, guys, here today is just to make him understand, get the engine revving a bit. That's what it is, you know. And you can see very clearly. Sometimes it's emotional. Sometimes. It can be a trauma, whatever it is, but logically and rationally, there is no sense being made. There is no sense being made at the moment. I mean, but in the meantime, guys, please donate, inshallah. <laughs> we are raising funds, inshallah. Please donate whatever you can, brothers and sisters. Yeah, inshallah. But yeah, alhamdulillah, it's going good so far, alhamdulillah. Yeah. So we, you know, we, the thing is, he keeps saying that there is no oh, evidence. No, 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 no. There's no evidence for God. But the guy has no clue what evidence he's seeking. And he, at the end, he did say at least, he admitted that it requires course, empirical yeah. evidence. But the thing is, you don't have empirical evidence for your own consciousness. Why? Because his consciousness is from metaphysics, oh. from a metaphysical realm. It's on not that, something which on, is physical. On that point, why My is it important? Here, so I gotta go. Yeah, yeah. It's yeah. nice talking sure. to you, man. Yeah. Yeah. But, As I said, we can yeah, agree yeah, to yeah. that. By, by the way, do you know that your consciousness is metaphysical, not physical? I don't know what you mean by metaphysical. Like, like it's not, it's not, means, it's not touch means you can't you ex see. examine it in you a lab yeah. under a microscope. Fair enough. But you believe it anyway by faith. Sure. So you're not different to us. Thank you very much. Take care, take care. Finally, we agree.